Hi, scientists. I'm Professor Beakers. I'm so glad you came to join us for our science videos because we have so much fun. But you know what's more fun? Is if you can do it with us. So if you want your very own Beakers box, where you can get everything you need to do the experiments and activities with us, ask mom or dad to go over to www.beakerscience.com and sign up to get a monthly box so you can jump on in and do it with us. All right, I hope to see you soon. See you later. friends, Professor Beakers here. Doggo and I are so excited to have you join us in the Beakers lab. Don't forget your safety goggles, your science apron, and mom, dad, or another adult because we don't do experiments on our own. So come join us in the Beakers lab for your next science lesson. Hi scientists, Professor Beakers here, and our friend Doggo. Are you guys ready to learn about the scientific method? Let's go. The scientific method has five steps. Step number one, you're already experts at it, asking questions. My scientist friends say that you ask hundreds of questions a day. Is this true? If so, we're ready to go. Let's ask a scientific question. What might float higher, a balloon or a bubble? Hmm, I don't know. We're gonna move to step two. Make your very best guess. In science, we call this a hypothesis. What's your guess? It looks like our friend here thinks a balloon might float higher. And she thinks a bubble. I'm not sure. We have to move on to step three, my favorite part. Experiment time! We're going to let a balloon go. We're gonna let some bubbles go, and we're gonna watch and see what happens. Then we move on to step four. Record our data. Every good scientist has to do this step. We watch, see what happens, and we write it down, everything we see, so that we can remember what happened. Step five, the most important part. We learned something new. Whether we guessed right or wrong, it doesn't matter because we learned and we can carry this on into all of our other experiments. Now that we know the scientific method, let's go explore some more. We will see you next time. Bye.